Hello, and welcome to the Daily Message. I am Sally Messner, Director of Worship and Music at Holy Cross. Today is Friday, May 8th. Today we'll do something a little bit differently than the last couple of times that, I've, uh, that I have led the Daily Message. Um, I will lead us in a brief form of daily prayer, mostly based on evening prayer, and then you'll see a different setting for the rest of the video. We will practice together Rock of Ages, Cleft for Me. And while it's not a hymn that we might need to practice, because a lot of us know it, um, we might be singing it a little differently than what you're used to when we sing it this coming Sunday um, over live stream worship. So I thought it would be good to practice it. So when we get to that point, um, after this part of the video, um, it'll cut to a different scene, a different place, you'll see. Uh, and then we'll sing those first two verses of Rock of Ages. It's number 623 in your ELW. Jesus Christ is the light of the world, the light no darkness can overcome. Stay with us, Lord, for it is evening and the day is almost over. Let your light scatter the darkness and illumine your church. God is our light and our salvation, our refuge and our stronghold. From the rising of the sun to its setting, we praise your name, O God. For with you is the fountain of life, and in your light we see light. We give you thanks, O God, for in the beginning you called light into being. And you set lights in the sky to govern night and day. In a pillar of cloud by day and a pillar of fire by night, you led your people into freedom. Enlighten our darkness by the light of your Christ. May your word be a lamp to our feet and a light to our path. For you are merciful, and you love your whole creation, and with all your creatures we give you glory, through your Son, Jesus Christ, in the unity of the Holy Spirit, now and forever. Psalm 121. I lift up my eyes to the hills. From where will my help come? My help comes from the Lord, who made heaven and earth. God will not let your foot be moved. God who keeps you will not slumber. He who keeps Israel will neither slumber nor sleep. The Lord is your keeper. The Lord is your shade at your right hand. The sun shall not strike you by day, nor the moon by night. The Lord will keep you from all evil. God will keep your life. The Lord will keep your going out and your coming in from this time on and forevermore. And a reading from Genesis chapter 12. Now the Lord said to Abram, Go from your country and your kindred and your father's house to the land that I will show you. I will make of you a great nation, and I will bless you and make your name great, so that you will be a blessing. I will bless those who bless you, and the one who curses you I will curse. And in you all the families of the earth shall be blessed. Long ago, God spoke to our ancestors in many and various ways by the prophets. But in these last days, God has spoken to us by the Son. O 
Almighty God, your Holy Spirit equips the church with a rich variety of gifts. Grant that we may use them to bear witness to Christ in lives that are built on faith and love. Make us ready to live the gospel and eager to do your will so that we may share with all your church in the joys of eternal life. Gracious and holy God, give us diligence to seek you, wisdom to perceive you, and patience to wait for you. Grant us, O God, a mind to meditate on you, eyes to behold you, ears to listen for your word, a heart to love you, and a life to proclaim you. O God, you have called your servants to ventures of which we cannot see the ending, by paths as yet untrodden, through perils unknown. Give us faith to go out with good courage, not knowing where we go, but only that your hand is leading us and your love supporting us. Through Jesus Christ, our Lord. Amen. Lord, remember us in your kingdom and teach us to pray. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom and the power and the glory forever and ever. Amen. The peace of God, which surpasses all understanding, keep our hearts and our minds in Christ Jesus. Amen. Jesus is risen. The tomb is empty. Be smart. Be safe, and let's sing along on Rock of Ages. Hey everybody, I am outside at Holy Cross Lutheran Church under this beautiful tree outside the uh, east entrance near the music office. I moved all my stuff in. Um, it's windy out here, so I hope that my page stays open. There's also some work going on, so it might be noisy, but let's practice Rock of Ages. Oh, for sin could not atone. 